Oh, there you are. Welcome to Gradbo Warriors School Bus. Today's theme is centered around the word excellence. Excellence means the habit of producing high quality work in all that you do. I'll take it again. The habit of producing high quality work in all that you do. Excellence is spelled as E X C E L L E N C E I'll take it again. E just got hired as a janitor at a school. On his first day on the job, he gets to work very early. But when he walks into the janitor's closet to huh? get supplies, he finds it in a complete mess. Quickly, Mufuth begins to clean it up before going to his duties. The next day, Mufud walks into the school and is shocked to see the other workers, teachers, and school principal clapping and cheering for him as they present him an award for cleaning the janitor's closet, which was a test for him as a new worker. Welcome to Value Express with Gamora and I. Today's question is from Super Gringo and it reads Mamawura, my dad will soon be back from a very long trip in a few days from now and I haven't finished cleaning the attic as instructed. So, I plan to stack up a few things up here and there while cleaning up the little places in sight so he doesn't know I didn't finish cleaning up the entire attic. At least, you'll still be happy to see the articles clean, right? Mm, oh no, please don't do that, you know. If your dad finds out you did not carry out his instructions, then you would get into trouble. But, if you do things better than expected of you, you would be building in yourself the habit of doing quality work in all that you do. And that is excellence. Thank you, friends. Bye. It's time for an African. Hello children, welcome to another segment of African Proverbs. And today's African Proverb says, Those who accomplish great things, pay attention to little ones. I'll take it again. Those who accomplish great things, pay attention to little ones. Now, time to interpret but with some help. So, I'll give you options. Does it mean A, 
great people like small things. How does it mean B? In order to be great, we must pay attention to little details. I'll take it again. Does it mean A? Great people like small things. Or does it mean B? In order to be great, we must pay attention to little details. Time to interpret. You have a few seconds to give me the meaning of the proverb. Your time starts now. <gasps> correct! The correct answer is B. In order to be great, we must pay attention to little details. Now, let's put it in a song! This is Music Street. A little ones. If you want to accomplish great things, you've got to get it done. You've got to pay attention. Pay attention to the details. You've got to pay attention. Pay attention to the details. A little ones. If you want to accomplish great things, you've got to get it done. You've got to pay attention. Pay attention to the details. You've got to pay attention. Pay attention to the details. Excellent swimmers and have been spotted in 100 kilometers offshore. Okay, so who said the polar bears couldn't try out for the Olympics? So they are really hairy, have sharp teeth, and sometimes get attracted to human meat. Why should I ever stop anyone from pursuing their dreams? If they ever make it to the Olympics, just not be able to fill them. Let's date them. So children, making it a habit that all you do is of high quality standard and excellence builds you for future projects. This is Grand Mawura saying that until we come your way again on the Grand Mawura school bus, bye bye. Today, we learned about the word excellence and that having the habit of producing high quality work in everything that we do will build a habit of making excellent work. We also learned that polar bears happen to be excellent swimmers. See you next time on the Grandma Wara School Bus Ride. <laughs> I hope you enjoyed the ride as much as I did. Drop me a comment if there is a comment box or send me a mail on what you've learned with your parents' supervision on Grandmawura School Bus at gmail.com. Also follow on Facebook and Instagram at Grandmawura for more interactions with me. Catch you soon! <laughs>